This is the EcoTura 510 Off-Road. If you haven't seen the EcoTura before, then you have to check it out. It's well built, it uses lots of clever lateral thinking. So if you're a couple and you need a fairly lightweight rig that's really easy to tow, then this one should definitely be on your list. I really want to show you this. Now the first thing that I noticed about the EcoTura is just how easy it is to set up. In fact, I reckon it's easier to set up this than any conventional pop top out on the market at the moment. Especially if you've got a cordless drill. It's just a matter of winding up the mechanism. Then you can hop inside, lift up the front wall, latch it into place, lower a small flap, lock that in, and you're done. A major point of difference with the EcoTura is how the drawbar can fold up to significantly reduce the overall length. Fantastic when it's time to store the van. Just fit the second jockey wheel to support the van's nose weight. And wind out these side nuts to loosen the drawbar. Now our off-road model has come with this slide out kitchen. It's got a two burner Dometic cooktop, a removable sink, but there are no taps here. Instead, you use the external shower. Now there are a number of different layout options within the EcoTura range. But I really like this one. This rear club lounge is very comfortable. Love the surrounding windows. It's great for watching the world go by. Now much of the interior is made up of molded fiberglass with very few joins. And I have to say it's seamless and very refined. In terms of features, you've got lots of 12 volt points, a microwave, an underbench compressor fridge, a gas stove, sink, a little vanity sink in the corner as well. And that bathroom is surprisingly spacious. In fact, from the outside, you probably wouldn't think this van has a bathroom at all. For remote touring, the off-road EcoTourer comes with Cruise Master suspension, dual 145 watt solar panels, and one 120 amp hour lithium battery, which is looked after by the onboard Red Arc battery management system. Now the guys at Caravan Court in Victoria have been building the EcoTura for many, many years. And for two people, a van like this just makes complete sense to me. It's got a low towing profile, which makes it easy to tow and it's gonna be more fuel efficient as well. So we've been putting this van through its paces out in the bush, nothing's gone wrong, nothing's broken, and I see no reason why this van wouldn't be a fantastic touring companion.